BC 15 Sonoran Living Live. Adventure. Your health. Your life. This is Sonoran Living Live. All right, well, if you do want to take your exercise outside, then we know how damaging the sun can be. But did you know that you may be at risk even when you're inside, like Kaylee, or even running errands? Dr. Susan Van Dyke is a dermatologist, and you say there are actually some things that we can do to protect ourselves when we're driving in the car, running our errands. But I didn't really realize I was at that great of risk if I'm not laying out or spending exactly. a lot of time. Exactly. You know, everybody knows what to do when you go to the beach. Right. We all know you use sunscreen, you wear protective clothing, and you go early, you go late. So we're done with that. Although the reality is that when they do the studies, only half the women actually wear sunscreen when they go to the beach, and only 25% of the men do. Right. But the real thing that we're talking about... Our kids about, do, but we don't. <laughs> exactly. You know, you squirt them as they're going out the door, but not us. But the, uh, the interesting thing is that almost 80% of the sun damage that you're getting is incidental. Incidental meaning you don't even know you're in the sun. Really? I've got this great story of a, a patient who's a, a man and uh, obviously a lot of sun damage. And I said, you know, as part of the history, what, you get a lot of sun. He goes, no, I don't. Okay. All right. Now, what do you do for fun? Well, I play golf. Okay. How many times a week do you play golf? Three. And this man plays golf three times a week. I'm thinking, is there like a night course here or something? Right, right. He's in the sun, but he honestly doesn't know that. To him, that's in an incidental sun exposure. He does not understand that he's in the sun. So it may be more obvious for us. Like when you said golf, okay, yeah, he's outside. Yeah, well, he's got a little denial going on, but we've got maybe a little denial going on sitting uh, on the, the freeway waiting in traffic, mm -hmm. arm out the window, or even more so, arm in the window, window's closed, and you think... You don't even think. That's the thing. You don't think. Right. So what can you do? Number one take-home message is the sun does not care what you think you're doing. If the sun is hitting you, it's hitting you and you're getting sun damage. Okay. So what can we do about it? Well, here's a good mindset because it's really about changing your mindset. Is prepare for the day as if you're going to end up at the beach some point during this day. Okay. Or pretend you live in the desert. Oh, yes, we do live in the desert. Oh, right, right. But you got to put your so mind that way. So instead of just putting it when, we're, when we know we're going to go and hang out by the pool, we're, we're taking the same measures that we would. But it's, sometimes the sunscreen is so, um, I don't know, it's kind of slippery heavy and it makes us kind of heavy and yeah. hot. Well, there's a way around that. First of all, when you go out in the morning, throw stuff in your car that, say you did get stuck in the middle of the desert that you'd want. A wide-brimmed hat, for instance. Mm -hmm. I mean, that's not a sunscreen and that's not icky. Um, uh, what else could you do? Big sunglasses. Okay. Throw them in the car. Throw some sunscreen in the car too. I would tell you that there are so many choices on sunscreen that I just can't believe that you can't find something. It has something come a long way, like. baby, hadn't it? We yeah. can do 70 sunscreens. We can do squirt bottle sunscreens. We have, uh, you know, that's really not a good excuse. I think the biggest thing is you have to think about it. And, you know, throw it in the car. Right. And the third point I'd like to make is you got to keep it simple because I'm not going to do complicated things. I'm a soccer mom. Mm -hmm. You know. One thing you throw in the car, an umbrella. Okay, it doesn't have to be a rain right. umbrella, but right. a golf got umbrella. One up here. That's right. You know, just you stick can make it. it a fashion statement. You can make. You know, I got a nice pink one here, but you can uh, stick it on your chair while you're watching the soccer game. Also, on your daily routine, you know, I get up in the morning and I, I put, use anti-aging cream. I'm in my 50s and I don't want to get any older looking. Uh -huh. Um, one product that I use is by Kinerase. It's a great anti-aging cream. By who? Kinerase. Kinerase. And we've got a little sample here, but okay. the reason I like it, it's got a little orange dot on it that says 30. It's got an SPF 30 built into it. And so that's what it. we're looking for, is the 30 and above? What is there I'm above? interested, uh, there's, there are okay. above. But what I'm interested in is how many, what can I do in one step? Okay. So, for instance, if we're, we're using an anti-aging cream and it has an SPF, I don't think of it as a sunscreen. I think of it as this is my anti-aging cream. And, oh, by the way, there's a 30 in it, so I don't have to worry about it anymore. Okay. I, wanna, I don't want to let you go before we talk about the lips because, you know, that's... Hollywood makes us so aware of them, and we all want beautiful, you know, luscious lips. And right. But what are we? What should we be doing to well, you know kind what? of prevent Another them from getting a beating? To keep it simple, is part of your daily skincare. Again, uh, Kinerase and other companies make lip treatments that heal lips. But more importantly, there are lipsticks. For instance, Jane Iredale, a mineral makeup line. Their lipsticks have 18 SPF in them. Oh. Don't have to think about it. Yeah. Their foundations have 18 SPF. Many companies do. So you're getting up in the morning, you're putting your anti-aging cream on with your SPF in it mm -hmm. and your makeup mm -hmm. and your in the car in case you get stuck in the desert. Right. And look for shade. 
obvious look for shade. That is keeping it simple. It doesn't have to be this big, oh, it's time to put the sunscreen on. And we all remember our face. That's some good tips. Thanks a lot. You're welcome. I liked that. Simple, simple. Simple, simple. All right.